Seems my big thrills lately have been happening in London, Ontario. A few weeks back, I was piloting a U.S. Navy jet fighter rocketing into the future. And then last Friday, a trip back in time to the first day radio station CKSL went on the air in London. And I was the kid who signed on. Last week was the station's 25th anniversary, and they invited me to return to do the morning show once again, and maybe this time get it right. The building is still the same. The elevator is still the same. Uh, even the picture of me in the lobby hasn't changed. 1956. I look like an undernourished Buddy Holly. And upstairs, things hadn't changed that much either. Oh, that's right. Same old clock on the studio wall. The control room still had the original McCurdy board. And their regular morning man, Peter Garland, and I worked out of the same announce booth. They even embarrassed me by playing a commercial I had recorded in 1956. The evening weather cast was brought to you by Padfield Motors. For up-to-the-minute weather information throughout the day, dial 1290-CKSL. <laughs> Good Lord, <laughs> that was me in 1956. I sounded like a young Howard Cosell. Oh, and there's the weather. <laughs> in the old days, three young broadcasters named Al Baliska, Tom McKee, and Bob McAdory all lived above a variety store in London. We were always broke, but uh, at least I had a tab at the grocery store. Two days before payday, I'd be going down there to get a can of scrim, three cans of scrim on, on the cup. And one would go to the McKee family, one to the Ballistas, and one to the Mackinars. That's how we lived, really. In those days. It was a great morning of nostalgia and beautiful memories, complete with birthday cakes, champagne for breakfast yet, and uh, even a singing telegram to end the show. There's none to us dearer than our one and only first morning man. We're glad to have you back and see you've returned to find a major legend in your mind. Spirit of London, CKSL, you're so alive. Happy birthday to you. So full of mirth, you. Happy birthday, 25. I think we just sent radio back 25 years. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Jim, from Singing Telegram. Yeah, you got any more fat stomach over there? <laughs> Anything. Fat. <laughs> Congratulations to CKSL on their silver anniversary. Thank you for your hospitality, and especially thank you for this. This is the uh, very microphone that I spoke into on that June morning 25 years ago. And the inscription on it reads, uh, to the, the CKSL Open Mouth Award to our first morning breath. Bob McAdory, 1956, from the CKSL staff of 1981. Thank you once again, and congratulations. Speaking